If your ink too slow and your nib won't flow, here's one of the places that you can go. Larry is here to see you through with Mr. Announcer and Cubby too. It's Larry's Fountain Pen Review. Hello folks, this is Larry and welcome back. I'm Larry with Larry's Fountain Pen Review. It's been a while since I did a review, so why not? Let's do one today. Right, feel pretty good. And I've got a pretty cool pen, so why not? Let's do the magic. Are you ready? Okay, well, what I'd like to show you right now is a beautiful pen. Gorgeous looking pen. One of my favorite all pens, yes. Uh, it's a Platinum, the Platinum 3776, a beautiful blue translucent fountain pen uh, with this beautiful gold trim hardware on it. It's just a lovely fountain pen. And a special thank you from a friend of mine that sent me this pen. Now, this pen would come in a pen case like this, which I took it out. And inside, you have platinum, and of course you have your cards, your information, and you have a cartridge, and uh, this came with a uh, converter, and thank you to a friend of mine who got me not only the pen, but the converter as well to go with it. The converter is about 11 bucks extra with the pen. Yeah, it didn't come with the pen, but you know, the pen is a decent price. It's not cheap by no means, but still, it's a decent price. Uh, beautiful fountain pen, and in my opinion, I think they write superbly. Uh, I've been checking out the pen and writing with it for a while. So, you know, what I like about uh, this pen, one of my favorite all time, the gold trim accent on pens is, is my favorite, I would have to say. And it uses the proprietary platinum cartridge and or the converter, which I'll open it up in a minute and show you. Of course, the whole body cap barrel is resin, really nicely done. And yes, it is unscrewable and it is postable for those who like to post their pens. The length of the pen when it's closed, just like it is here, it's going to be overall 5.5 .5 inches. But then when you post the pen, it's going to come back at a 6.3 inches. And the weight of the pen is going to be 20 Gs. That's with no ink in it at all. Okay. Really beautiful, gorgeous fountain pen. I really enjoy this pen a lot. Now, these pens come in four different sizes. The ultra fine, extra fine, fine, and medium. And what is really cool about these pens, they have that slip seal mechanism inside that will print, prevent the ink from drying up up to 24 months. Now that's pretty awesome. Yep, I like that. So Platinum has a lot going for it for uh, the money they ask for it which in my opinion, I think is really affordable. So if you're looking for a really nice fountain pen with a really sweet nib, then I recommend this pen. You can't go wrong with it. Either way, it's a win-win. The price, the nib, smooth, wet, beautiful blue, translucent. It's just really a knockout with this gold trim accent on it. I, I really like it. So what I want to do next is let's do a writing sample and I'm going to use the endless, uh, no I'm not, I'm going to use the Ayush. Yes, yeah, I thought I was going to use the endless for a minute but I have the Ayush out so why not use that, right Mr. Announcer? Sure. So you know for those who want to see it, post it again there but before I get going too fast as I go down this barrel, there's not really a step off there but right here in the barrel where the cap screws into the barrel. Nothing's going to be that. That's going to be annoying, sharp, or get in the way. 
And the grip is not a very big grip section, but it's big enough. Uh, I have small fingers, so no problem. But if you have big, chunky fingers, it's going to uh, work just fine. Uh, so, you know, I write here at times, but sometimes I catch myself writing from here. I don't know why. I just, that's how I do it, I guess. And let's take a close look at this nib before I get going any further. Beautiful nib. It's a medium nib on it. Beautiful nib. And remember, like I always said, the harder the pen is the nib. If your nib's no good, your, your pen is worthless. That's just my opinion. So anyway, here is the converter. And it's the push-down converter, which I really like. Like, this one, you just push it in and pull it out. Really simple. Uh, and then, of course, it's twist. So it's inked up, and it's ready to do some bad jam here. So, uh... Let's get going with this. So, like I said, really is a beautiful fountain pen. And uh, the person who got this for me wants to remain silent. So, this review was sponsored by the silent friend who got me this pen. Thank you so much, sir. I do appreciate it, and you know I do. Mm-hmm. Lazy dog. All right, and this is the platinum. Uh, the platinum with the blue. Bu -bu -bu. With a blue transmitter, 377. So talking to myself. With a 14K medium nib in reverse writing, of course. And no problems whatsoever. It writes just as nice reverse. You can get a, a totally different line variation or the regular way as it was intended to write. Okay. That's is here. It's got really good ink flow and nice smooth nip. It's just a great writer. Beautiful pen. Great writer. And you can't go wrong with the pen. So there you have it. Uh, and the ink is Robert Orster Blue Ink, so there you have that. Now, one last thing before I go. I'm just going to show you some other pens, uh, kind of see what it matches up to. Here's just a simple Jin Hao, I believe, 992. And when you compare them in size, this 3776 is a bit taller. Of course, it has more girth to it, but just to give you an idea. And get that old beautiful preppy out here, which I really like. That preppy's about the same size, maybe a hair longer, and almost the same girth to it, but that's pretty close. So, anyway, there you have it, the Platinum 3776, beautiful fountain pen. Thank you, folks, for joining me today. I appreciate you taking your time for letting me in your home today, office, wherever you may be. I'm always with you. A lot of peace and love coming your way, my friend. A lot of hugs and kisses your way. And remember, be kind to a stranger. And as always, please, don't text and don't drive. Save a life. Maybe, in fact, save your own life. Later, folks.